Joker. Let's go. Okay. This is my annual attempt at killing Judo. Persona 5 Tactica. What's up, guys? Jay here, and welcome to part 10 of Persona 5 Tactica. And considering what happened last week, it might be the last episode, so let's see what happens. So, uh, last game, we, uh, uh, the main villain of this game tried to traumatize uh, Toshiro with a, a giant uh, deformed version of Ari, so. Yeah. That's all. I, that, that face is still stuck in my head. <laughs> it's sad. Do I have any missile? Okay, dokey. There's lots of boom I don't booms. have any haze. Okay, it's all sitting in Judo's arena. That's cool. Nine turns. You don't go. have time to be lazy. Pick up the pace. Are you still laughing that I'm still traumatized by that boss? No, no. Just... <laughs> Video I've got on in the background. <laughs> Ow! Just... All my health is gone. Went well to go, babe. <laughs> What's a health yeah. bar? What's a health bar? <laughs> We're playing Batman Arkham Asylum where you have three hit points. Yeah. <laughs> you can only get hit three times. If you're lucky. Brother, I'm level 111. Mm -hmm. I still don't have enough health. Uh, so just for context, let me just jump over. Ah, uh, cause I don't think I was too much high on levels. I'm like Endgame, by the way. Mm hmm. I know. <laughs> this is my annual attempt at killing judo. <laughs> I pre temp of Code Vein every year, and I try again. Because I just cannot do it. This is the year. Ernesto. Okay, oh, how did that miss me? Oh. That has been a good while since I jumped on this. Oh my god, a regen inducer. Pog. Show them our strength. That hit me regardless. That! Kill it. Okay. Jesus Christ. Judge. All right, let's see. For me, uh, 170. That's what my level was when I ended up beating the game. That was literally pretty much the majority of what I had in terms of levels, and my weapons were. It was a bayonet and a one-handed sword. I'm a big two-handed guy. Two I mean, why not? Level Does... nine okay, Arena, don't go over Is that why you've got that Can big axe in Baldur's Gate? I mean, to be fair though, if there was a big weapon, you will use the big weapon. Yeah, yeah you, you, you like can only weapon. resist. Well yes. <laughs> You can only resist the urge to not use the big weapon for so long. Hmm. You make it sound like it's a path to right. <laughs> yes, it is. <laughs> it's a rite of passage. Um, and yes, just to add for the people who watch the YouTube channel, 
we are actually planning to do Bald Skate on the channel when we get an opportunity to. And for, especially when it comes to cross-platform, which the devs have been teasing at, as far as I can I know. Uh, I'd say give them quite a bit of time though. Just do it, be safe, because... I mean, they're working on a big fun game across multiple platforms. So, the best, best advice I have is just give them time. Or as a wise man once said, let them cook. It's over. This raises some clarity. There. Joker took out an enemy. I do. Oh, right. Okay. This iron will. We fight together. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Let's go. Here I go. Oh, yeah, that's the heal move. That is the beam. Arena can only attack the exploding barrels. Excellent position, Arena. Firing. I don't want to attack the barrels. What do I look like? The Donkey Kong? Take it down. Ah. Yeah. Oh. Jack, don't perceive to tell me that you think I know what I'm doing. I don't know what I'm doing, Jack. <laughs> you know what you're oh. doing, right? I have literally no idea what I'm doing. Oh, fuck, I'm gonna die. Shit. And I'm not gonna make it to you. Oh, 59 HP right now. The inner sea of thieves. Dodge, dodge, dodge. Nice position. You'll be well hit. <laughs> okay, we're down one enemy. Jack, shut up. It's perfect. over. I You'll mean. be safe there. I need the thing! Give me the thing! I've made it to Judo, but I'm almost dead. There's a dude dying on the floor here. It's a shame. We got this. We got this in the bag. Is that where my haze is? Why is it over there? Oh no. Oh, oh no. Where was oh. that? Give it my That's the worst thing to happen. What the fuck is you that? It's one place, you, it's in somewhere else. I yeah. thought it was in Judo. Maybe it is in Judo's arena. I just can't no, see it because of the map. I assume it's in Judo's arena. See, that times I've gotten lost in this game is crazy. It feels good when you can perfect a level like that. To be fair, a lot of a lot of code vein does sort of suffer from. Oh, uh, cutscene. Cutscene. The the really, uh, really fucking what? annoying what? areas that take way too long to navigate. Is that? That voice. There, there's no battery. Mari. We have to face that bitch, mm -hmm. Mari, again. <laughs> Uh, AJ, welcome to welcome to the boss rush. <laughs> it's a boss rush mode. Wait, does that mean I have to get a face against traumatized the arena again? Check in on the lift, we're going. I mean, just wait to see. You can't do anything on your own. You think rebelling now will do you any good? You're nothing but a wind up dog. Give it up already. There's no point. Say what you want, but you're wasting your time. Ooh, I, I can pressing walk on my own two legs now. So I'm taking this will of mine. Yeah, I will be brutally honest. Near, near enough parry becomes almost useless. I near know. end game. <laughs> it's good for like the like three enemies you encounter um, right near the end, and that's it. Kira. Right. Hi. Yes, your wife is in the chat. Oh, now the lift wants to go down. Hey, nope, we're going up. Bye, Jack. Jack's dead. <laughs> Jack fell off the lift. My wife. You have no right to keep people down. That's a Let's go, everybody. This is a fight we can't lose. It's <gasps> a yeah. This is a boss rush mode, isn't it? Why are you not stunned? I'm having fun. Shit. I've it's been it. shot. 
the battlefield is just like a boss fight as well. I'm dead. Thank you, Jack. Jack is dead. I have joined him in death. Why is she metal? Is she Mel Sonic Mario? Here's what happens. I die before I even get to judo and then I go, maybe I should play a new game. Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> maybe I, I mean, restart. to be fair, that is very code vein. <laughs> Yeah, it's like maybe I should very uh, save and return to title screen and start a new run. <laughs> I mean, I mean, all right, look, I'd mostly go back just to, uh, you know, I've got a bit of a craving just to mess with the character creator. Let's just mess with that again. You dreamt about uh, I'm craving to hate myself. Let's go. <laughs> yeah, let's go. You dreamt about Shadow the Hedgehog again. Hell yeah. All right. oh, my son. Oh, um, for some reason I was checking on Twitter and there was like this tier list, but it was saying what someone thought everyone's, um, nationality would be in Sonic characters. I mm. saw somebody put Sonic Adventure 2 in, in, in C tier. Do I need to kill the bouquets? Again? Could this be? Yeah, do I need I mean, to yeah, I mean, study the boss fight. If you remember the boss fight, you remember some stuff you can do. Yes, by remembering, do I need to kill the bouquets? Uh, I don't think you need to kill the bouquets, I don't believe they're an actual enemy. What you only have one main goal for the fight. Toshiro, attack the one in front of you, not the side ones. Thank you. Okay. Also, the drone YouTubers were there. The ones who did the Matt Meryl Bieber. Oh, Droppy? I watched Droppy last night. I have not watched that channel in a little while, I'll be honest. I love Droppy. But, God, it, it's. It's always fun to watch, but I don't know, just someone like, I watch the channel every now and then. I I, re I, I rewatched their uh, finishing each other sketches. Oh, oh God! It was the one. <laughs> no, it was the the kind of Halloween themed one. Mm, it's just always that idea, though. Is uh, oh, yeah. Although God. getting getting to watch Nathan do Jacob's persona again, that was also funny. I love the Persona episode. It's very... It's just fun. It's, it's I mean? Because it's very sincere. <laughs> that helps a lot. I mean, to be fair though, if that's kind of the whole point with art though, is... I mean, if you can't have fun with it, there's not too much of a point trying to do it, is there? Now I remember what you do with the bouquets. You lure her into them. There we go. Now you remember it. I'm very dumb, right? <laughs> I guess I'd study the fight. Kira sent me to do a drawing Shadow the Hedgehog challenge with Draw Fate to earn a coin with Shadow on it. I was trying to collect three coins for some reason. Simon was there too. It was a whole plot. That's insane. That does sound like me. <laughs> That's not out of the realm of something I would do. I wonder, can I, can I see what looks better with this? Can I? Speaking of Shadow the Hedgehog... Come to my side! Can you get through this? Yes. I can't wait to kill this person properly. There we go. That's really good. I'm gonna pop blind. the back. Over the here. And then the, the extension color is red. Nice position. You'll be well hidden. Oh, oh Jesus. Jesus. Okay, let's. Shall we do this? Nice 
Okay, no. 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 It does seem like this is just gonna be a chip battle. I'll do my best. Nice position. You'll be well hidden. Oh, wait, no one. No arms done for good. Way to go. I'm glad I brought Haru. I'll do. Well, then. Here I go. You made it perfectly. Hell yeah. I'll take care of this. Oh, fuck. We're out for a challenge now. Nice position. You'll be well hidden. So. A bit of a discussion I want to bring up to be in part of Persona. In the main Persona game, Persona 5, what do you guys think would have been the most annoying boss fight? Uh, so, just to make sure, this is just base Persona 5, this is not Royal. Do you want to count Royal? Uh, that's why I'm asking, because we all know who's immediately on the top of the list. Akumara? There you go. So, this is I oh, yeah, hated time it. I, it. I, I'm gonna be honest, I thought Akuma was harder in the original. What was different in the original? Not much. I just remember it being harder. Maybe it's because it was the first time I was doing it. Possibly. That's perfect. You'll be safe there. I mean, for first times, everyone's not great. Yeah, it was not fun though. Well, everyone remembers what happened when I did it. I mean, I would. I played through on hard mode. I think it took me two tries. That makes you feel know. Do you want fuck Code Vein? I'm playing Persona 5 Royal. Uh, oh right, the tank. I forgot about the tank. I completely forgot about the tank. Is there a chandelier here as well? I still have a whole month. Um, it feels like it's been useful just sticking Haru in the corner and just junk writing. I'll, I'll just call it junk writing. I'm trying to remember. Um, what happened? I remember I nearly beat Shido first time, didn't I? I mean, that was a fight that was. Doctors have been kind of scamming me <laughs> for a couple of years. Okay, Arena. I mean, to be fair, with Shido, the fight technically is harder, depending on, like, if you're not prepared. As in, if you only use, like, the full party all the time. Otherwise, it's not too much of a. Uh... I haven't done this, like, killed the Reaper. Yeah. I'm ready. As some game plusing, but was have I you on the twins? What to do? Uh. Yeah. Oh wow, you don't wait. You fought the twins, but didn't do the Reaper. Yeah. So it's my turn. Okay. That's fine with me. But just, I don't know. Just feels very uh. Very bizarre. Um, do a new new game so makes it makes suggesting that Hatsune Miku is the hardest the Persona 5 boss. Always <laughs> What are the rocks for again? Isn't that I mean, just a boulder? Probably, you know, That's cover. A fucking tank. Yes, that is and a And this tank. is a gun. You said oh. that just like, God, the arena's gone out. <laughs> Unless that was a point. For context, I do not have the stream up. That makes it even more funny. Hmm. Seems the synergy factor I <laughs> seems my hidden synergy factor is working again. Run's got telepathy. <laughs> that explains. Oh 
the thing is, when I was um, trying to do the um... Yeah, probably, probably more of a why, man. When I was trying to do the editing for the CEFES video last uh, the other day, I couldn't find the scene where we were hog tailing, was it? Club hauling. Club hauling. Right. What? what do you think of hog tailing? That is, that's <laughs> skedaddling. That's I'll do my, best. my point still stands. Basically, on. were <laughs> at one yeah. point, I believe. Mike, Mike, Mike can confirm it. We nearly hit I mean, a rock. I mean, I can't. Well, no, that was drifting. <laughs> I think the term you look for is drifting, Jay. No, where I drifted the boat. Where you, where you, yeah, where you lower the anchor and you fucking yeehaw spin. Mm-hmm. Yep. Club hauling. I didn't know there was a proper term for that. Do you know where I got it from? Oh, no. Oh, no. Captain Barbosa. Oh, of course. He says it in the in the fight with Davy Jones in, in, the, it is, in the whirlpool. It has been... So long. Come on, lads, we're a club hauling! It has been so long since I've watched any of those movies. Yeah, same. Oh, it has been so long. They're always good movies, though. Always a good watch. A new New Game Plus. Uh, Joker is not in a good position. Probably not. Oh, damn. Go to hell! Hmm. Blows up pancakes with mine for real. <laughs> My fucking pancake. Uh, I think Joker's gonna get hit whether I want him to or not. Uh, oh, I forgot on my completed. So I'm trying to do another new game plus save. There we but I have to go through the dialogue at the end of the game. Mm -hmm. I hate going through that. They just have to say the very sad goodbye to everyone. Yeah. I can skip through all of it, so it's fine. <laughs> they should put how to name me. <laughs> I went through it once before. You can't break me again. God damn it! You're breaking me again. Oh. Marie is down. I repeat, Marie is down. Very smooth, Noir. You really are the beauty. A direct hit. Classic Noir. You're doing great. So it's my turn. Our unbreakable result. Nice, there you go. I think that everyone is constantly like, bro, you don't eat enough. <laughs> to Joker. <laughs> Dude, you need to eat a bit more. I'm fine. The big bang burger. I'm fine. I forgot that if you choose the dialogue option, uh, where Mona is like, plus we gotta make sure he doesn't turn back into a delinquent. You go, I was never a delinquent. And fucking Morgana responds, really? All right. <laughs> really? Ooh, that's okay. Do this now. Let's finish this. Let's go. With style. Nah, uh, first substance. Janet. She don't feel so good. Does that mean we're gonna have to face daddy now? Considering we're to take off that bitch wife. There's only two genders. Daddy <laughs> and bitch wife. <laughs> Who hurt you? Who hurt you? <laughs> you. <laughs> I should write that down. Oh. I'm trying to think of what game to play next after this, but I kind of want to stay away from tactical RPGs, so I can't play Sparks of Hope right away. Even though I really want to play Sparks of Hope. What are some of the fun games you can steal from me? All 
of them, mate. I own a lot of games. Baldur's Bait is one of them. Graham from Baldur's uh, As soon as I get cross I have the Bendy game. series. Baldi's Basics? <laughs> Bro, you could play Scarlet Nexus. What's that? Uh, it, it, it's like Code Vein. <laughs> it's it's not it's it's not a Souls like gamer. <laughs> Whatever. It just feels like the whole joke half time is like, oh yeah, no, it's basically a Souls like. Oh yeah, well Bandai Namco makes like the same six games every year. I mean, true, it is Bandai. Uh, basically, it's like this anime sci-fi game where you run around fighting monsters and there's like a funky two two stories to it from two perspectives uh i like it it's funky as hell wait so astral chain yeah <laughs> yakuza games if if you want <laughs> just don't complete them <laughs> don't go for completion don't complete them they're great Bro, you can play no i mean like don't try and strive for like a hundred percent because oh yeah Yikes. <laughs> the ambush yeah. skill set allows units to automatically shoot at enemies once they move into firing range. I have like, so many games. Yakuza is one of the worst games in terms of completion just because they're so freaking so much. I, I'm uh, just like, get me through the story, bro, and I'll be okay. Meg, what is Dream Daddy? Uh, 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 Hot Men <laughs> Dating Sim. I ain't doing that. <laughs> Do you wish to perform? Say you uh <laughs> Which persona feel like there's uh, it's like a push being made for certain things. Someone be a little bit thirsty. Let's make this guy. I mean get some water. Is this persona please wait just a moment? I hope this doesn't become an accidental fusion. Mm. I think that was the best part about Persona 5. Like, there was like a whole randomized part of the stream every time. I mean, accident fusion is always a consistent thing in the series. The only main difference, it, I'd probably say, is when it comes to Royal, where there is a way to force it to happen. Are you finished? Uh, and then also create like literal, actually broken personas that can win every Are single you fight. Like oh hey, I love how I have this persona that was weak to bless, now it got absorbed bless because it was an accident fusion. Yeah. I still need to finish, uh, P3R. I, I, uh, I... I got really in a bad situation with that game. I'm talking about Persona 3 Reload Gamer. The, I, the I know one. what you're about, but in general. Also, Akihiko, voiced by one of my favorite guys in the world, Alejandro Sa, but I keep talking about him like constantly. <laughs> <laughs> this is the third time this week. In the last three days, I've talked about this man, but I love him. Oh, yeah, I was about to know. say, third time this week, we're only on freaking Monday! Sorry, third time, I've talked about him at least once in the <laughs> last barely, three days. He barely started the week! I know. I talked about him yesterday, I talked about him the day before, and I'm talking about him again today, I love <laughs> Gun. It's gun. No, don't you mean the neutral? Which makes it even worse because we're actually on that franchise that Neem is referencing. Now I need to make another what persona like because do? I accidentally used the one I just made. Which persona will you choose? Uh, I will openly say this with Tactica. There was probably only one problem I think I found. The persona? Uh, like, no, you are out. Well, first, yes, the persona abilities. I don't like how they did it. Second, there is a flat amount of money you can actually earn. So eventually you'll like, run dry. You, yes. Like, you will eventually hit a point where you can literally buy nothing. And you just have to go into that last fight. Oh, this makes so much more sense. Which, uh... Let's just say... Boy, me on the fight, right on the fight. 
right before the final fight, trying to get most of Compendium filled. Boy howdy, that took a f <laughs> That did not get finished. Ouch. I got, I think, 78%, I think? I think I'll give this persona to Anne. I mean, to be fair, a lot of them I did use on weapons as well, because... Oh god, the weapons were really good. I think something I have to say about some of our royal. Anne is broken. <laughs> Her AoE attacks are so good. Oh. Almost everyone's AoE is really good. My party usually you by see? end game. It's what would you like to do? Which persona like, will normal you end, like, Pre DLC like end do? game. Which it's usually, what would you like? Which persona will you usually? I've got Makoto in there. Makoto. What would you like to be fair, Makoto's always just the, one of the strongest supports, though, isn't she? Yeah, and then like? I'll throw which in persona will you probably choose? Ryuji what for fizz like damage. Do? Which persona mm. will you choose? And then. I either put in it's usually Haru or On. Kind of flick between both of them. I remember I used um, Morgana as the main healer. I did use I do usually use Morgana as main healer because he go crazy with that. Because right. for whatever reason, if it's a wind character, it's a healing character. <laughs> yeah. I. I mean, I think the only exception to that is four. <laughs> Yeah, I was about to say, like, four is probably the <laughs> only exception, the only exception to that. Where it's like, yeah, he it's, has healing it's for, like, Yukari two, in three, is, two it's, abilities. It's Morgana in five, but, ooh, is it rough in four. <laughs> four, the instead, it's like, the, four instead, it's the one that has the, <laughs> the one that has the highest magic damage half the time. Mm. Which is, hey, if you don't use this character, what are you doing? This is literally the only healer you get for half the game. Yeah. <laughs> All of them are stuck in there. And your other two options, I mean, one of them only heals a little bit, and the other one doesn't come for a while. Wonder who was it? Yeah. Do you remember when I saw Red was being a, a Naoto guy? <laughs> 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 yeah, true. I do remember, <laughs> yep. <laughs> Which, uh... <laughs> I don't know why I did that. <laughs> it just felt it in my soul. <laughs> you felt it in the soul. Like, press a Naoto guy, I can feel it. <laughs> uh, was was I wrong? I can't remember. <laughs> um, I don't think I ever gave a conclusive answer. I don't think. Because I don't think I even know. <laughs> <laughs> That's the twist. Even I, I don't know. How fucked am I if I don't even know? I'm a Risei guy till I die. <laughs> oh god, no, not Risei. I love Risei. <laughs> uh. Oh yeah, boy. <laughs> Casually talking about P4, bro. You're a Naoto guy. <laughs> you're a Naoto guy. Mac, I don't know what they're talking about. They're talking about Persona 4 gamer. <laughs> oh, bro, you can play Persona 4. You can yoink that off. Yeah. I'm waiting for the remake for that. I mean, technically, Persona 4 did get a remake. It was called Golden. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Which is like, for most part, the definitive edition. Yeah. I don't think they're gonna do it up again. I that's what they said for three. Doubt it. That's what they said for three. I, well, no, well, because three is a lot more. I would say, out of popularity, five and three are the the more popular ones. I don't, I don't think people appreciate four as much as they do three and five. <laughs> I mean, I'd say with Sides, give us Persona five, 6, definitely. you cowards. Atlas, Atlas, I'm calling you right now. Give us Persona 6. Stop making spin-offs. Give us the next one. Oh man, I can't wait to play Persona Q3. Oh my god. 
Boy, what the frick are you doing this time? <laughs> what fanfic are you going with this time? I know. The Persona Q is so what? I mean, I'm, I'm, I've beaten the entirety of Q1. I'm most of the way through Q2. I just, the problem is I've got a storage problem. So I, I can't re-download. Because uh, shockingly is the thing that takes the most space. But yeah. Boy, oh boy. There's one thing I can compliment with Persona Q, it's how the Persona has been used. As the only compliment I can outright give it. Yes, it's broken. I do not care. I do not care, I love having two Personas at the exact same time. Overkill. Eh, I mean, not, eh, not really. Not unless you run, like... Oh hey, I have resist everything because I've resisted my weakness. Uh, I also have endgame spells. In my current, in my run on P3R, I am... Um, Cause I have, cause I, cause I pre, cause I'm a pre-order special boy. Yeah, I have a bunch of the, the DLC stuff. So oh, you I'm, have the, the I'm rocking, ar I'm rocking around with Satan Tensei. <laughs> like I'm rocking around with Ryuji's persona. Does that mean <laughs> fucking An's persona? I mean, I mean the funniest thing just, is, I just have one persona that resists basically all magic. Just yeah. so I can just be like, I don't know what this thing does, but it's bozo. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm gonna just throw whip you out. out I don't quick. know what you're doing. <laughs> I don't know what this thing does. You. Yeah. <laughs> Everybody else is getting their ass handed to them. I'm just gonna have like uh, a little uh, my defense boy. <laughs> a little safety bubble. <laughs> my defense boy. My defensive persona. I mean, I feel like I could definitely say that's one thing that can happen really quickly and easily, depending on what abilities you're given all the time. I mean, I'm halfway through, basically. Well, no, I'm at the last full moon. I'm coming up to it. Mm -hmm. uh, and... Uh, who am I running? I'm running Yukari Mitsuru. Akihiko. Because that's the squad. Alrighty. Uh, but I haven't had Junpei in my party like the whole game, so he's level like 32, <laughs> and everyone else is like level almost level 50. Why you mean stupid? Yeah. There we go. <laughs> so like I'm trying to level everybody up. I fucking love. I just Kuro, Maru, and Ken are also like, still in the 30s. I was like, about to say than, they're almost at level 40, you, but. Did, Junpei um, keeps dying in the fight, so then he doesn't get any XP at the end of it. <laughs> yeah, did the <laughs> did no they problem. actually buff up Ken and Karamaru in um, reload compared to normal? Oh, Karam Karamaru. Got well, it's you know, well you know they have decent, decent. one ability it is called support because <laughs> their other skills are instant kill, which you can't use, and oh, they, instant kill you can't use. Now. Yeah, there's less Good. of that. Now. It's They've given Ken and Koromaru more phase attacks. More actual attacks, finally. Yeah. Show it decent. Also, I'm like... I mean, at least I know if, yeah, if I I'm coming up on the last full moon, and I'm, it's occurring to me I don't have a social link with half of C's. Uh-oh. Yet I've uh, maxed you, Kari. From I think from what I'm hearing, I think Mitsuru's comes like games. right near the end. Yeah, Mitsuru's you can only do uh, late game. Hers is literally Aki, one of I the worst don't. ones. It's not there. That was good boom boom. The man does not exist. Wait, what? Like, I can't, like I've hung out with him a bunch, but it's mostly just cooking. <laughs> Which does not count as social events. <laughs> really? Witness our power so, I maxed out the old couple really quickly. Old couple? And the track team. Yeah, it's when the confidants in. In three. In three. 
maxed out the old couple track team like super quick. And then I maxed out Yukari. Because I, I used to go for Mitsuru, but I was like, I don't know, Yukari hits different. In reload. <laughs> for some reason. Um. I'm level 9 with the guy who tries to date the teacher. I mean, to be fair, that's pretty, that's pretty standard with Persona at one point. Yeah. There's always somehow that one. I mean, in Persona yeah. 5, you can Kamishida. date the teacher. Well, you can date Kamishida. N no! You can date... You can date... Um... Oh, what's the name? <laughs> I forgot the name. Kamishida! <laughs> My man, no. Oh my god! No, Kamashita, no. That his problem <laughs> that is what he that is what he was Jesus Christ. No, what is her name? Oh my that's god. A, that's literally like what the, the fuck is her worst name? option. <laughs> what the fuck is her name? Wait. <laughs> like Jesus, the worst social <laughs> The literal worst social link in the series, Kamoshida. God. What is there's so many cave names. Yeah. <laughs> what is her name? I can't remember it. There we go. Uh, Kimami or Kawaii? I'm trying to think, that's the problem. I'm also trying not to load a fucking internet to. Say, oh hey, this is my character. Let me get the names. Yay. Nice well, well, isn't most of Japanese names start with K? Uh, not really. I mean, it, it depends. Because, um. I mean, it just depends. Sato, but that's Genshin. <laughs> that's not what it is. I feel like it's close to that, though. Kaka... She literally gave me chocolate and all that ten minutes ago. Someone said chocolate. I, so <laughs> I gave her so- I have her social rank maxed. Because her mage shit is really helpful. Mm-hmm. Oh, hey, do you want to do an extra activity for, like, Do I want to be able to go out at night also? again after being in the palace for six hours? Absolutely I do. I'm not gonna get his broken just... benefits. Hell yeah! Whip them into shit. Mm. That's perfect. You'll be safe there. Damn garbage! I'm blind. I'm perfectly ready. I'll cut you down. Uh, uh, nice going, boss. Uh, uh, Kamehameha. Figure it out. The Kamehameha. I wouldn't want to. That call me a mama. What is her name? You're really you know insane. <laughs> what? I'm in constant dialogue. This is a big fight. I can now look at my confidants. My yeah. <laughs> Kawakami. There we go. Who did I? Okay, let's look at all the people I maxed out in P5R on my first run. So we got Morgana, Makoto, Ryuji, Akechi, uh, Takemi, Kawakami, Mishima, uh, Toronosuke, Sai, Sumere, and Maruki. I got. Nice cover. Sounds bad. I only had. I got on to level 9. And then I also Ooh. got. A Yusuke was only level 2. <laughs> Oof. I never used Yusuke. <laughs> I was desperately trying to get Haru's up. Uh, uh, but where, I only got her to 6 by to? the end of the game. Uh, where's Futaba? Uh, and I only had Sojuro at 8. Futaba? 5. Which I know is a bad idea because her 
I mean, it's, support is incredible. I was, and I, I was about to, to say that. like it's the that's sort of a consistent pattern though with Persona is if you somehow do dedicate with the support the support character, then OP you are not to her second awakening. I was so close though. <laughs> I feel like I'm kind of struggling with this fight. It's taking forever. I'm not losing. I remember, I remember, the, I remember in the original game, uh, I did get Futabas to max. Purely by accident, to be honest. The two best ones for me, with, um, Futaba, was if you get ambushed. She, she has a chance to change it around so it's a regular fight, and mm. the, she also has no, a I'm... chance to make it into an instant standoff as soon as the fight starts. I mean, I think one of the things people would probably say with Futaba is probably Final Guard. Oh, if you're about to die, like, block the damage completely. Yeah, I remember the first time, it was in Persona 5, the original, mm -hmm. and I accidentally maxed out Futaba's thing. Cause I just was like, oh, she's the only one available, fuck it, I'll hang out with Futaba. Uh, yeah. Uh, and it's then oh got boy. the, 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 the tag talk, scene. Yeah, the talk. Like, and I was like, I'm a I am incredibly bro. uncomfortable. Shut your mouth. Huh? I am your older brother. This is weird. I, I am. Incredibly uncomfortable. Help. Do people judge me for doing that? Nice for romancing Futaba? Yeah. I mean, probably. Probably. <laughs> I mean, remember, you're asking, like, do people. People always judge. I'm gonna be honest, brother. When you told me you ran Futaba, I went, you did what? Huh? Huh? I like the nerds, alright? There's a chess nerd right there. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, yeah, true, actually. There's a nerd that, that's... <laughs> I, like I mean, the, oh... Alright, I like the computer nerds, alright? I mean, I will openly say, like, I... I know it's random, but... Eh, I just randomly enjoy chess now and then. I haven't played chess like in a while. Nice I did romance, uh, oh, he me at one point, in one of my runs. That was fun. I am now. I thought it was so strange that they changed Takami's voice actor for this game. Because the voice actor is so wildly different compared to the one in the first one. Yeah, it's. I remember when I heard her weird. speak for the first time in Royal, and I was like, "Who are you? Oh, wait, Who are you're you? not. You're not the you're doctor. Not, wait, you're not. Who are you? Not her. How, how did you get in here? Like, how did you get in this room? What have you done with Tai Takemi? <laughs> Who's where? Station Square. Let's go see Yoshida. Okay, I'm getting really sick of these umbrella for the minions. Hello, Toronosuke. Uh, so outright, Jay, my best strategy for them half the time was try to force them to point one way, and then ambush from the other side. Look at the screen. Look at the stream. That, and look how bad that's. That or is. um, that or have something that has like big area of effect, just sort of pull their attention away. Plus, don't forget, you do have like a lot of movement type abilities. Let's do this. Like, one thing you're not, you should not be lacking is mobility. Also, in my first playthrough of Persona 5 Royal, I never found the kid, the video game kid. Never found oh, gamer. it. Oh, oh, gamer. Like, yeah. I just walked to the arcade <laughs> now. I'm at Endgame. And, and it's like, oh hey, well, to the we can, oh hey, no, he starts socially. Like, Fuck. Shit. 
I absolutely love when my, I do it every time I play Persona 5. Max Ryuji, immediately. <laughs> I mean... Max confident Ryuji as fast as possible. Can I not- can I not grab a gun? Oh, bye, why? It's just like, I heard you're going home tomorrow, bye. I have Max him either. This is my first- first? First? First playthrough of Royal. Yeah, I mean, you gotta be able to have a run where you can just sort of mess about a bit and yeah, do your own thing for a while. Yeah, it's great. Also, Max, there's no point. Ah, uh, yeah, everyone's favorite part of Persona, raising that knowledge stat. Yeah. Oh no, I did. I did max all my stats. Okay. Uh, all those times I had to flip them down, flip them down. Questions in the game. Well, you know, the fun thing about, you know, P3, there's only three of them. True, like, it's, it is quite condensed, meaning that, I, I don't think the limits were different, were they? Like, I think if it was, like, Kawakami, please, and not, like, I think it was not just still had to do the most for it, but. I found it so funny that you helped Kawakami become a better teacher by <laughs> being... By, by hiring her as a maid, it's so I was weird. I was about to say, Story by, like, so kind of blackmailing it. her. I mean, it's not really kind blackmailing. Of? It's her <laughs> idea to be like, you tell nobody about this, and I'll let a few things slide at school. Well you're like, <laughs> I mean, that's what I mean by, like, kinda. Because you're not the one that does it. <laughs> well, the thing is, I kind of fucked her up uh, in that regard, because uh, I didn't touch the confidence whatsoever. Boy, how do you, uh, that might explain why you struggle with a few things. Yeah, bro. Because, uh... It's so useful. Yeah, just woo up your fucking it's... school teacher. You have to woo her, you just have to talk to her. <laughs> you just have to listen to the person's problems. You just have to help her with her life problems. <laughs> Kira, she, she gives you... Kira. She gives you slack off. She sees you in a maid outfit. You see her in a maid outfit, first of all, gamer. If Joker could be in a maid outfit, I would have it at all times. She does. Oh, do I have a website? She, she, <laughs> I've seen it. She she'll make coffee. She'll wash the dirty clothes you find in in uh, palaces for you, which is great. Mm -hmm. In free time in other places, classes, so you can study or make infiltration tools, which is great. She'll make you curry or infiltration tools, and also she'll give you a massage that lets you go out into the world after being in the palace, which is so useful. Because uh, again, it's literally also, an extra Mishima's thing to do. Also, so good. Um, I think that says how long that took. It asked me to do it in nine turns. I used 17. Jesus Christ. How long were you fighting one on brown enemy? I'm mad. How long? It doesn't help that it was on a single lane. So I couldn't g exactly. J Jay! You can. Like, I'm pretty sure there is a way to get people to the other side. Not really, no. Did you study the map properly and make sure? What? It's only a one way route. So there's no way to get behind. At all. There's no. not like a side like panel or something that bounces you. No, there wasn't. Boy, I've not done that fight for a while then, so I don't remember what happens. I, I, one, the ones that I always, always max rank 
it's Mishima and the politician. Always. Because Mishima is just like. His final one is allows backup members to earn the same XP as current. Partners. Yeah, which is. Insane. Yikes. The, so good like for you, it, it's it's so much worse going into a brand new file, like no new game plus, and not having that for a while, and you're like, oh my god, it's I wild. Uh, it's, it's uh, fun seeing everyone being at roughly the same level though. I don't know how, but somehow in my new game plus run, but I. Uh, nice uh, that I think I have, if everyone in the party, everyone's very close to like level nice over level 100, right? Nice. But then there's like Sumere and Kichi who are still in the 90s somehow. <laughs> I, was, I was about to say like the two characters that literally come in somehow. at the end of the game. I'm like, I why literally are they so under leveled. What? I've literally had them in the party. Akechi's my boy, I love him. He's my favorite character. Pancake. Nah! Pancake, he's my favorite character and I will stand by that. <laughs> uh, still so fucking stupid when you realize the one thing that screwed up his plan was fucking pancakes. Pancakes. <laughs> so funny. Like, wow. Such an amazing sophisticated plan. Ruined by one thing. So I mean, think about it, his entire plan, it was perfect the until he plan said was by the fact that he could hear Morgana say pancakes. <laughs> the second he said pancakes, the plan was foiled. Backups were being made to counteract his plan. And it's just weirdly ironic. I mean, look at all those Eggman's robots. I mean, to be fair, I'm pretty sure your main goal, as always, is beat the boss and then the fight's over. This isn't a boss, it's just a regular fight. Oh, okay. Oh, right, you're in one of the... on the last few. Keep forgetting that. I do forget occasionally there is an one or two just normal fights. But hey, when was the last time I went through Tactica? All oh, right, that was <laughs> that was a, a, probably around about a year ago. Right, let's go. Probably, I don't know. I lost track of time. All right.
perfectly ready. Hold the stick! Wreck it! Bunk, you're on what? a roll! Bad, can you get through get this? Ready. All right, let's go! That's it, Tojiro! We'll fight that together! Perfect! Cutscene. Show them our strength! Yes, yes, I get it for Tabo. So graceful! Panther's living up to her name! Okay, yeah, if you say that again, you're not invited to the party. It's a shame that this game doesn't have dash. Eh. I mean, you do enough damage already, to be honest. Dash would just be a bit overkill. Especially like, oh hey, who gets the most dash? Ah yes, yeah, like a total of 18 dash somehow. Speaking of dash... Uh, what's a balance? <laughs> What's a balance? Speaking of yeah. Dash, Akira. Hi. I did a bit of research earlier trying to see if there's anything else I should know about with Baldur's Gate. Uh huh. Will we eventually be able to get a second class? Brother, you could do that now. How? Right, um. So on your next level up, you can press a button to multi class. Oh, damn it, I'm trying to think of, like, dumbest melee class possible. Well, or would be the dumbest the melee arc. class. Four enemies remaining. Hang in there. Right, what would, what would be the funniest thing to pair with a barbarian? A bard. <laughs> you know what, yeah, sure. Okay. The bard barbarian. Oh, do you know what I ended up doing? So in my run with uh, Ben, we are in endgame. Oh. Okay. Of, of Baldur's Gate, and on my final level, because max level in Baldur's Gate is 12, on my final level, I have one level in Fighter. Okay. So I could get a uh, proficiency in certain so weapons. So I'm level 11 Bard, one level Fighter. Nice. But it also means now I can use silly dialogue options specifically oh, for Fighter. Yes! So, when we got to the refugee camp, in Act 3, uh, there's like guards guarding this like f uh, barn with like s donations for the refugees in it. And I, I walked up and he was like, What the fuck are you doing? You can't come in here. This is for the refugees. So I could fighter deception. Flaming Fist Moss reporting for duty, sir. I was ordered to check out the barn as a deception. And because I'm a bard and my charisma is super high, oh, I no. have deficient. I have deception per, per proficiency. Nah. <laughs> so I get like a plus. I think I get a plus six to deception checks. So I got it so quick. But I thought it was so funny watching my silly, stupid little bard with the spider's liar on their back, being like, reporting for duty, gamer. <laughs> reporting for duty. I want to see this thing. By order of, uh, what's his face? The Flaming Fist. Lord Enver Gortash has ordered me to be here. <laughs> also, I man. hate that man. I don't know why people simp for him. I don't know, I have to go through the whole fucking shit. No. Let's go. I forgot to do a, a new game plus. I now have to fucking go through the end oh. credits again. Yeah. Drives me nuts for real. Go on. Not the end credits, no. I get to watch the little things of uh, all the characters doing their stuff. 
There's something I never understood about the ending. Uh, what? Mm. Their names got cleared at the end of the game, right? Uh, so why would it still was shown that the they were not... Well, because, uh, he's still a criminal. Yeah, no, he still has a record. Yeah. Technically. Bro's been to jail. <laughs> sure, it was a, a false year in charge, jail. Bro. But, like... I thought that was the whole also, of course, they're gonna investigate. I thought that like, was the whole point of Sai's son clearing his name at the end. So it's my turn. But yes, but... The problem is, a record is a record. Like, that, that doesn't it's just get really wiped away. It's not his name, it was him being, yeah, I am the Phantom Thieves, and we have been running, I am running this criminal organization. However, we're not the bad guys here. But, like, the police were like, you still broke the law, though, gamer. Yeah, exactly, yeah. Like, the, like it's not just all, like, Crystal clean, hunky dory. You're like, we did not, we were not, we did not do the murder. We, however, we did not kill this man. However, we did screw with people's heads. However, interfering with police investigation. I'll show no mercy. Hi, Binky. That's Persona. <laughs> <Hi, Binky. laughs> yeah, the cat, the one that's responsible for interfering with police investigations. <laughs> Finally made their appearance. Should I say hi? As far as I can tell, Binky's already um, famous on our channel, so. Binky's a yapper. I wonder if I should make him up, Binky. Got me uh, a t shirt from her holiday. And basically, it's a black t-shirt, but the graphic on it is basically, if the mon- Like, if, if, if the Mona Lisa was a KISS fan. Which I think is great. I mean, why not? Love it. Sweet Solus Prime. Brother, I want you to just swear for once in your life. <laughs> <laughs> once in your life. To remove the filter. What's wrong with me not swearing? Well, I mean, it's basically inspired your def- your- Yes, definitely your catchphrase, not catchphrase, oh scrap. Which- I swear I hear you say at least like Which three my times in a day. Is now at this point, please just say fuck. <laughs> I mean, to, to be fair, that's not a bad catch. Please just say fuck. <laughs> <laughs> and how how long should we wait until this gets onto a t-shirt? Studio Mappa worked on uh -oh. Persona 5 Royal. Uh oh. I never knew that! Yeah, that? Holy shit, Studio Mappa, they made uh, a bunch. They're huge anime studio. They did Yuriana, Tsukaisen, uh. Well, I'm gonna do a hmm. Google. If I could guess, they probably are responsible for all the cutscenes then, if I had to guess. Yeah. Which, I mean, Joe? Sure. Amazing. Let's see, okay, so cool. Studio Mappa has done Kakaguri. Dirty on Ice, Terror in Resonance, Vinland Saga, Punchline, The Grand Blue Fantasy, The Animation, Attack on Titan. I still need to watch that. Uh, Zombieland Saga, Kaizen, <laughs> no, Dororo, they, they've done The God of High School, Banana Fish, uh, they did Ushio Totora, which is an anime that I love. That I have never met anybody else who's fucking seen it. <laughs> uh, campfire cooking in another world with an absurd skill. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I remember hearing that one in passing. Uh, Hajime no Ippo. So it's my Doro Hedro. Um, I remember seeing this really weird anime recently about like some elf. Oh, um, uh, the weight loss one. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. What? 
what? Uh, there's there's the anime at the moment going on where it's about an elf that. Uh, I don't know exactly what's uh, going on with it. But, like they either lose weight or they gain weight. I don't remember what the thing yeah. is. All I've it's all weird. it is is I've seen it in passing. It's very uh, and has an obsession with apparently with the uh, <laughs> French fries. I've been given another shift. What's going on here? Oh no! Oh, I have. You've been given another shift this week. Yeah. Yes. Ten, ten to three. On Thursday, I was only working four days this week, so that's fine. I'm now just in work Thursday. It's a weird shift, though. Ten to three. Mm-hmm. I'll take it. But still, it doesn't change the fact that it's a bit weird. I'll take it. It's a weird shift, but I'll take it. it just means I'm, I'm working Thursday now. And it's not Friday. I am gamer. I am working from Wednesday throughout the week. And uh, I have Friday off next week, though. See if he's guaranteed. And the week after that. Double bill. So the next two weeks I have Friday off. So if that doesn't change. So it's my turn. I'll let you know if it does change and he puts me in for another shift. I'm so surprised that my manager is so tight-fisted about giving out more shit. Somebody must have called in. Somebody must have asked for that off. Mad. Oh, big ups to me though, I get more money. <laughs> Who else needs money? Watch them out! Nice cover! Prepare yourself! Get ready! Nice position, Mona! Sona. Most of these turns I'm having makes it so I can't. Some of my characters can't do much. I mean, you are near end game, so they're gonna try and pull some stuff like this on you. I mean, if they don't, it's clear. I can't use that to and there's the annoying umbrella bitch again. You're gonna hate me now, because I need to say something. Mm. Scrap. For the love of God. There it is. <laughs> there's the cash raise. That's the For censorship, the love of God, baby. Say fuck. <laughs> <laughs> You're actually getting annoyed at it. Bro, it drives me insane. <laughs> the, the censorship is real. I think we we'll have to get in touch with Volcano see if we can do a compilation of every time Kira said just fucking swear. Along um, with the fair, compilation. To be fair, my man, you do sort of need <laughs> like, like this is not like I'm pretty sure this is an 18 plus channel. <laughs> so I mean. You can! You can say the thing! You can say the line, Jay! <laughs> you and your also, I saw Brain Rod of the new Hasbun Hotel song. Like the Brain Rod version. Which is so... it was so funny. I have tried to show Mike off the Hasbun Hotel. Um. Jay, I've just pulled up the stream. What? Why did you go right next to the explosive barrel? Because no one's here to shoot it. I guess, but still, that's incredibly risky. 
everything I do in Is the game. minute someone hits, then that's it. The minute they can hit it, they will hit it. Let's do this. You kidding me? Minute can crank it. No, that should be. Uh, yeah, uh, there we um, go. I wouldn't waste the triple. I'm trying to increase. Not unless the you can rates. grab more in. Wipe them out. You can grab more enemies in it. Do the triple. Get ready. There we go. This is where you die. What have you found? Persona. The brain rot version of the new husband. Time to the curtain. Yeah, I have tried to show Mike off to husband hotel, but I don't think he's interested. They're not husband hotel. Uh, I mean, hell of a boss. I mean, to be fair, Jay, I am also half time incredibly tired. I spoke to you about it the, the other new day. hell of a boss episode. But I... yes, but Jay, work. Work, work does take over life sometimes. The on the way. I don't even know if I'm going to show with this boy that will keep telling me how Wipe terrible it is. I mean, I just, I'm working, I work, in, I work with people. I mean, working in retail sucks. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Retail sucks ass. You have to deal with some people that are just the worst. Mm. Also, Jay. You're fight. You're not doing the fight right. If you're doing that, don't shoot them while they're covering. Get them out of cover. 15. Otherwise, you're losing damage potential. Yes, oh my god, shit! Fifty tons. Oh, shut up! I'm struggling. I've made it clear. May remember melee is an option. Oh look, here comes Daddy. Christ. Next up is. Oh. Do you still like, my man, I love strategy. This strategy is making me want to stop strategizing. <laughs> I'm starting a new run on Persona 5 right now. Speedrun record for Persona 5 Royal is. Hmm, interesting question. Okay, we, for this we need to work around speed. Am I right? 
more speed we have, the more we can get closer to uh, world's best dad. So the, okay. The fastest time that someone has speed run Persona 5 Royal, teen hours, 9 minutes and 58 seconds. 10 hours. 14 no, hours. Oh. And it is, it's a British person named Liv. Liv. Time to go wild. She, she speed ran in 14 hours. <laughs> Nine minutes. Dad, can you get through this? I can't uh, perfectly right now. I really hate those I ones. I really hate those enemies. So cool. Leave it to me. Dad? You hit him. Well done, Mona. What's the record? Way to go. Four. Four. Somebody speed ran Baldur's Gate and got it done in. So it's my turn. 20 minutes. How? There's also a sex speed run in Baldur's Gate. Someone, someone got sex done in two minutes. How? Oh. I'm struggling to fucking get going with Shadowhorn. I didn't even touch Kala. I don't know. Somebody speed ran sex. In Baldur's Gate, and they got it done in two minutes. That's so wild. I need to give relationship advice. That's so insane. Well, it's probably Miss Faro. Better get ready. I don't know. Gun. Let's get in there. Take that trigger, kid. <laughs> Cut them down. Nice position. You'll be well hidden. I won't miss. Okay, we're down one enemy. It's so okay to need it. Bye bye. I'll cut you down. Nice going, Bob. Let's do this. Do this. Get ready. All right, let's go. Wah, wah, wah. Leave it to me. Do this. Let's do this. So it's my turn. Leave it to me. Right, let's go! Witness our power as one! You're the best kid! You're doing well, Toshiro! Show them our strength! Do we remember? Take over the sound of the sound! Take over the sound of the sound! So it's my team! That's how I do it. Unbreakable resolve! Persona! Leave it to me! It's over for you! Come forth, my other half! Don't hit the cat. Don't hit the cat. Don't hit the pol- I, I, On this red case, I'll say don't hit the politician. Always hit politicians, kids. Life lesson for me. Never save politicians. Politicians should never be trusted. Nope. Alright, let's do this. Don't move now! New game plus on Merciless, let's go. Do this look. Witness our power as one! Show them our strength! Okay, so I need help getting rid of this guy. This is super low! Hurry up and heal! I'll cut them down. Leave it to me! Wipe them out!
You won't escape! A direct hit! Bugs, you're on a roll! I'll call you out. Let's see it again, Bugs! Let's do this! Persona! Don't mind being Persona! So the robot Zoro! Yeah, I'm kinda yeah, concerned I might have time killed Toshi. Oh, okay. I can't get up! Mm. Luckily, the game is in I'll cut them down. Leave it to me. Now it's my turn. Wipe them out. Let's do it. Gotta get ready. I'll cut them down. Leave it to me. All right, let's do this. Wipe them out. Get ready. Now it's my turn. But every time we get back up. Do, 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 do. Soda. Okay. Let's get injury. Can you get through this? I'll cut them down. Leave it to me. I'm perfectly ready. Let's do this. Wipe them out. Time to raise the curtain. Wipe them out, Goemon. Good going, Goemon. I am thou. I am thou. Thou art I. Thou has fucked up your ass, right? Let's see it again, Fox. Leave it to me. Come forth, my other Yes, you point finger. Better get ready. I'm perfectly ready. Get ready. Now it's my turn. I'm annoyed at that. Time to go wild. <laughs> I'll cut them down. Leave it to me. It's so good we needed. Behold the proof of my determination. <laughs> Still not close enough. Perfectly ready. Who's going for it? Who's in trouble? His health is really low. You're going down. Gotta get ready. I'll cut them down. I won't. Hit him hard. Hey. Oh, hit Mona. Now do it again. Wah wah. Time for my persona. Wah wah wah. Now it's my turn. I'm perfectly ready. Gotta get ready. Uh. Crap, I'm making this longer for myself. A biting love! Hold us down! It's not looking good! Good one! They can't hit you there! Your health is super low! Hurry up and heal! Alright, let's do this! Better get ready! I'm perfectly ready! I won't! Now it's my turn! Wipe them out! Better get ready. I'm perfectly ready. I won't. That did the trick. Bye bye. This is gonna hurt. Keep it up, Mona. Lift. Oh, 
Hold on a sec. <sighs> Let's get going. I'm still got the same amount of health though. The and Toshiro is still dead. Hmm. I'll cut them down. Let's do this. Uh. Don't mind being cast out. It's over for you. She's got a cheeky heel. Uh, let's put lift down for now. Persona! Zoro! Now it's my turn! Wipe them out! Time to raise the curtain! Better get ready! Show what we got! Better get ready. I'll cut them down. Let's do this. All right, let's do this. I'm perfectly ready. Get ready. Come forth, my other half. This should help. <laughs> <laughs> The same as Sarah Zona does a Lucio boop and Elios. Now it's my turn. Survive the triple threat. Look, I could do two.
I think it's safe to say that after this fight, that might be the end of the stream. Me getting really annoyed at a camera. Oh, that's so Baldur's Gate core. <laughs> camera goes insane. What? Oh, camera. Bro. camera. Oh, yeah, I said camera. Who? Like these ca it's like this line where if I cross it, it flipping. It does damage to the character right. that crossed it, but there's no way to get rid of it. Okay. Nice that there usually yeah, is a way to get rid of it. No you just don't. Uh, I mean, actually, no. I do see the way to get rid of it. Or at least for wherever Yuji is. If it's you just you. Kill the camera, it doesn't have a help. No. No, I didn't say kill the camera. I didn't even get to speak yet, Jay. Thanks. Uh, well, what's the gimmick of this, Jay? What's the gimmick of this fight? What are you doing? To get to him, but that one line is preventing me from doing that. Right, do you want me to give you the clue? With Ryuji, move on to the blue, but not on the line. And then swap over to someone on the other side to press the button. There we go. Now, you look back over Ryuji. Why did you run on the button, Jay? 
Don't run. Do my best. Get ready. You try. Right, the problem is you're rushing. No. No. The problem is you're trying to rush everything. Oh, man. Don't rush it. I did it by accident. I know, but still, just keep in mind, like the late that that camera is permanently there. If you're in line with it at all, it will shoot. Unless you're lower or higher than it. I will forever say that the most iconic Persona unlock cutscene is Joker's. I mean, probably, yeah. It's the yeah. best one. Get ready. I'll do my best. Let's do this. Here I go. I mean, because be it is a pretty good awakening scene. I, I would wager it's the best one. The look on his face, the blood melting off with the flames. Now do it again. Um, the, the fact that it, the fact that it, Arsen literally acts like a literal like melting coat at first. Yes. And then just forms. I mean, that is pretty good. The I will not deny look that. In Joker's eyes. Yep. <laughs> so good. I can't deny it. If I deny it, I'm an I idiot. I can deny it no longer. <laughs> I'm small. I'm small. <laughs> it's just the, the calm mannerism of it. I can deny, deny it no, it no longer. longer. I'm small. <laughs> just goes from like menacing tone to just. I'm small. To be honest, I end up you know, a couple a couple of nights ago. I end up I was on a what to about eight a. Uh, just chatting to, to random fucking Americans. But at one point, I, mean, why not? I was just in this lobby, and for a good solid hour and a half, we were just talking about SpongeBob. I mean, yeah, that sounds about right. Weirdly enough, somehow it always goes to SpongeBob. And then I'd also, we'd start talking about something else, and then somebody would say something, and then immediately start quoting SpongeBob again. I mean, it's the problem is it's it's hard not to quote it. It's very hard not to quote it, SpongeBob. We did it so fast, and then it turned into telling dad jokes and making puns while also mm -hmm. still quoting SpongeBob. Which was wild. <laughs> I'm nearly and then somebody came in and started screaming about the geopolitical uh, issues in the world, and we were like, "Okay, this ain't the vibe, brother. It's Saturday night. What the fuck? <laughs> we are not ready for this. We're just trying to vibe. At all. We're just, we're like, just trying to, we're just trying to live. We're just trying to vibe. This is conversation I want to be having. I might be drunk, but I'm not drunk enough for this. It's weird playing Overwatch when people are drunk. It's so fun! Well it's the best way to do it! I feel like it's one of two things. It's either the most unhinged people, or somehow like the most insane rambling people yeah, that's and there is no in between it's just one or the other whether i'm a chronic yapper you can't stop me i mean i be silenced do i have a problem i do not why because it's funny i just end up saying things like i was talking about the the the, the i was talking about cabaret the other day the film and the musical uh Tell me how I'd recommend it incredibly highly, but then trying to explain what cabaret is about. <laughs> without being it, it's like, a rabbit I, hole in the half. Like, how do I explain this without making it sound insane? <laughs> ah, so Yakuza. Ka yeah, kind of. Because, like, <laughs> once you, you start off being like, well, it's set in 19 Berlin. Okay. Is already a wild start. I mean, that's that's a pretty big start. Starting already. in 1940s Germany, insane. <laughs> Jesus. 
<laughs> yeah, that's that's how you start trying to explain what it's about. And I'm like, it's a musical, but it's also, uh, like, like I'm not good at explaining things. You just need to watch it. Yeah, it's it's, it's one really of the things that's better of show. Don't tell. Yeah. Because uh, if you try and tell, a it's like full well, recording. There's this weird thing that happens, and then there's this a... person does this thing, and then they yeah. did this, then this person backflipped off a bit. Yeah. Hold on, where'd the backflip come from? Yeah. Meanwhile, explaining it, I'm like, Jay, I don't think you'll like it. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, halfway through, I feel like, like I feel like with, with people like Jay, though, it's always the case of when you've spent enough time with people, you know immediately. It's like, yeah, you're not gonna, you're not gonna like this one. Am I really that predictable? I mean, it's not you specifically. It's just that's just how it is. Like people. Spend more time around you. Know more about you know what would be stuff you'd be interesting and stuff that you just really here's, wouldn't be bothered in. Cabaret preview review. <laughs> Tell the story of a nightclub in Berlin during the rise of fascism. Oh boy. <laughs> oh boy. Yeah. Yikes. But it's really. Good. That's All a, the characters that's a are insane. And a half. There is a so there's the movie version with Liza Minnelli in it, and that's really good. That's a really good watch. But then there's also on YouTube a full recording of the, of the uh, I think it was either 1980s or 1990s stage version. Yeah, 1993 stage version of Cabaret with Alan Cummings in it. I'll do my best. And he's he plays the MC, which is kind of like the MC is like kind of the not kind of the narrator almost of the, of the thing. Hmm. Which is a completely unhinged character. Ah, oh, my favorite kind of character sometimes. Yeah. And it's, it's just, it's so good watching Alan Cumming play this weird little slut on stage. <laughs> that's, uh... That's the only way to explain it, this weird <laughs> little not, slut. That's not a sentence I thought I would hear today. <laughs> I mean, one of the lines from the film is the MC. One from one of the lines from the show is is the MC going talking about one of the main characters. His name is Sally Bowles. She's a performer in the. I beat the dad. I in the, the club. Hell yeah! So the MC goes. The other day, I told her I want you for my wife. Your wife? What would she want with me? So that's like the kind of humor it is. <laughs> then it's also like, hey, there's fascism happening also at the same time. <laughs> it's uh, it sounds like a very awkward. Uh, it's a little bit jarring. Um, is it? Bad but that's that, the point. Is it bad that entire fight took twenty turns? Probably. How many did it recommend? And I lost like half of the Phantom Thieves. How many? <laughs> Did it? Yeah. Was it like? Well, um, I lost. Here's what you need. Uh, it didn't how, say many how many turns? turns. It didn't okay. Things. I like, lost. Take uh, as many as you like. <clears throat> I lost Toshiro, Yusuke, Ryuji, and. So here's. Are we fighting for my life and persona. So here's oh, Akihiko's one dead. Oh, Yukari's dead. Umitsuru's dead. One thing I did notice, Jay immediately was I think just as I popped back in I noticed that you'd lost Yusuke and there's a big reason why you lost him we didn't see eye-to-eye -eye in autistic relations no because you didn't have him in cover you had him out in the fucking open he likes to be eccentric Jay <laughs> Ah uh, yeah, he loves he loves to get smashed in the face by a rock two times, Bro which does like a hundred fucking. Confused. 
What does he expect after trying to flip and draw Anne and realizing she's got 50 pairs of clothes on? <laughs> this way, <laughs> you're pulling something from fucking the start of their, like, the start of their, like, introduction with the group. Yeah, it's so funny having, like, having Yusuke turn around and going, Oh. Huh? Have you gained weight? Like, and it's Anne Jay, in a hundred is... layers of clothes. Like, Jay, this is also the same type of logic as you hating fucking Junpei. Well, I'm not wrong. I mean, to be fair, it's hard to like Junpei at the beginning because he is annoying. Exactly. So, like, you just have to hold exactly. out. You have to hold, hold out for out. him. I hate Junpei. I hate you just Stupe. have to hold out for him. Just hold out. He gets his character. He yeah, gets there. I, I got to that character and I still didn't like him. Just don't like Maybe him. because for some reason you, you hold a grudge against the guy. Just don't He's a fucking teenager. Which, which Just character like arc him. are you talking about, gamer? Are you talking about the June hospital Bay. bit? Junpei with bit. three but Okay. Did Jay get to the hospital bit? I did? did? I don't even know. Yeah, I did, I did. They were trying to Do you know what them. I'm talking about? Yes, the yeah. weird woman in the dress, the, the drawing. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. I just don't like him. That's not even the complete. There's a worse part for him. Mm-hmm. Like, things get worse for him, and it destroys him mentally. Well, I won't touch that game, considering you need to have the been mental instability of a fly to react to that. Gamer, the new one is not like that. <laughs> I mean, here's the problem with Persona 3. It is very of the time. Mm. Like, a lot of themes in it, if they were done now, would probably get oh, that game blacklisted. They are doing the same themes. I mean, in the, the same theme sort is the of same, way. But they now have a content warning at the beginning. Yes. Like, if they didn't do like, content Like, you open warning, up the game, it's like, this game... Uh, discusses death, suicide, bullying. I'm Do you agree to not be offended knowing that you know about these things happening? And you go, yeah, cool. I'm glad that people it, are addressing No, well, unfortunately, we cannot offense. let you play this video game. Mm. No, I can't play There's a trigger video warning game. at the beginning of Persona 3 now. Are you planning to play um, Tadzuka Kira? No. Persona will you choose? <laughs> I mean, Tactica is... I hate games like that. Tactica is weird. I hate games like that. It's why I, I don't I don't enjoy them. They drive me nuts. It's like playing chess. But with anime characters. It's why I will not play... I just don't like the mechanics of it. And since you're not planning to play it, I have a legal right to show you something. Cool. <laughs> it's... Mike, you know what it is. So I don't plan on playing it. It's also that's also the reason why I will not play the Fire Emblem games, even though I probably really enjoy the story it's, of the it's Fire the, Emblem games. It's the gameplay. Though. I just don't like that kind of gameplay. Uh, that picture I just sent what you is. What is the screenshot you've sent me, gamer? That is a boss. I mean, and look at the face. I mean, there's penis bosses in this. What the? Fuck? <laughs> yeah, true. True. Shockingly. Yo. Persona is very <laughs> weird. Until with the uh, most... chibi horror. That pers that is the personification <laughs> of someone being run over by a train and somehow surviving it. <laughs> I'm telling you right now, that's not what somebody who's been run over by a train looks like, gamer. <laughs> I'm not joking. That's what happens to it. She got run over by a train. Don't think about what I said. <laughs> and how do you know what? How do you know what someone looks like when they've been pushed over by a train? I've been at the scene of an accident. <laughs> I mean, to be fair, Jay, you did ask. I did say don't think about what I said, but you you did. You thought about it. Exactly. <laughs> you you did yeah, think, people, and that's the problem. You know, throw them in self, throw themselves in front of trains here. That you know, I'm gonna see it at some point. Okay, we're gonna end big <laughs> Yeah. Um, Obviously, I was a bit wrong. This is not the end, considering I've been forced to go for a boss rush before the final boss. So, depending on how things go, tomorrow, ne next week could be the last episode of the Persona 5 Dad to go. But I'd like you guys in the comments to start right, sending recommendations of games you guys want uh, me to play after this game. 
Um, I am going to have a bit of a break from tactical RPGs though, so the next game we'll be playing, I'm hoping will be something different. But then after that we'll be playing uh, Mario and Rabbit Sparks of Hope. I've been wanting to do that one for a while, because it does look like it'll be fun. And I'm hoping to maybe use Bowser or Rabbit Rosalina. So... That was a choice of words. Uh, those are words that actually happen in the game. <laughs> I'll, I'll let Mike explain it while I finish off. But yeah. I don't know uh, what? <laughs> Kira was confused about me saying the words Bowser and Rabid Rosalina. No, no, no. Ba Rabid Rosalina I've just never heard of. Um, like, yeah, it's... It's, um... Sparks of Hope. They added new characters. They added, like, another version of a Rabid. Another rabid version of a character. What did you think it was just Rosalina or rabies or something? From uh, hearing it for the first time, yeah, I was like, "What is she going to mean... barrel?" And then I went, <laughs> and you were like, "It's a rabid version of like rabbits." And I'm like, "Oh, the little fucking oh, the, boys." The annoying things that I want to kick out the window. Yeah. No, I love oh, them. <laughs> I love trying to get them to the moon and then. Oh God, go home was a good time. It was so good. God damn it! <laughs> make, make me think. Makes me think of something I might have to bring up on Wednesday. That, that game should not have been as fun as it was. Mm. Right. That'll, <laughs> that'll be it for today, guys. Uh, thank you all for watching, and I'll see you guys on Friday for even more Sea of Thieves or more looking for the Shadow the Hedgehog type of Coco. So, see ya. Keyword: Bone Meringue. So. Bone Meringue. <laughs> bone Meringue. <laughs> I'm just waiting until. Uh, Literally, I'm just waiting until you get sponsorship, and then it's like, okay, use my code Bone Meringue. Bone Meringue. <laughs> That'd be actually really funny. Right. I have so right, many uh, games and no games. We've, we've got our new sponsor, uh, Gamer Subs, uh, with our new flavor. The new flavor, Bone Meringue. <laughs> bone Did meringue. you know there's a flavor of Gamer Subs called Titty Milk? Yep. Uh, I, uh, brand Risk as well. Apparently, I know about it that tastes. One. Like, like cotton candy. <laughs> I don't. So saith Alejandro Sab. So for context, Jay, that I believe that's a VTuber's flavor. Yes. I Titty milk. So I probably yeah. hold on. Yeah, I do believe that is true because, of course, it I'm makes looking up perfect gamer sense. Real quick. That'll be it for today, guys, and I'll see you next time. See ya.